Today is World Lupus Day and thousands of people are wearing purple to raise awareness about the autoimmune disease that is unpredictable and often misunderstood. According to the Lupus Foundation of America, 5 million people are living with lupus worldwide. One and a half million Americans are living with the disease, including me. I was diagnosed in 2019 after dealing with symptoms for 10 years and today thousands of Americans again are raising awareness to help solve this cruel mystery. So joining me now to talk about World Lupus Day is Lupus Ambassador Chance Gwen Schwartz. Good morning. Good Thanks morning. so much for joining. Thank you. Yeah, so could you talk a little bit about for people who don't know what is lupus? So lupus, like you said, is an autoimmune disease. Um, unfortunately, it is also called sometimes like a snowflake disease because it mimics so many other diseases or illnesses. So it's very hard to diagnose, which usually leaves people, believe it or not, taking about eight years to get diagnosed with their symptoms. So it's very unpredictable. It can affect anything. We actually have three different types of lupus. We have skin lupus. We have lupus that is more kidney related. And then we have SLE lupus is what I have, which affects numerous organs and can attack anything and everything at once. So I tell people, think of lupus as having a really bad flu and your body is fighting off that cold or that flu or that infection, but our bodies, as you know, see everything as an infection. It sees everything. So it constantly, our bodies attack ourselves. So most of us take medicine to keep us from having an immune system so it doesn't attack itself, which opens up a whole nother issue. Exactly, so my symptom was, you know, the bald spot in the head, in the scalp, and then of course, you try to figure out what's going on 10 years later, you realize that it wasn't something that had to do with maybe a relaxer gone wrong. It actually had something to do with lupus. And so that's when I found out from my dermatologist that you know it was something much more serious. So I deal with the skin and the immune system as well. So I totally understand. So could you talk a little bit about your journey with lupus? So my journey was unfortunately a very long one. I started having symptoms as a teenager. Um, and since I was a young, healthy teenager, it was just, oh, you're okay. It's stress, it's work, it's things like that. Um, here we fast forward 12 years later, um, got finally sent after two heart procedures, got sent to Mayo Clinic, spent a week at Mayo Clinic and was told we have, you have about six months to live unless we get this under control. So Mayo was an absolute lifesaver, literally to me. Um, I had very aggressive treatment right away. I've had chemo, numerous other things. I went from 13 medications, I'm down to six. So I take that as a win. Um, but yeah, it was, uh, it was a pretty long, unfortunate road to get the diagnosis. And a lot of my issues and symptoms could have been treated much earlier and cause less destruction. Absolutely, and the symptoms can be mild to severe, so thankfully you're okay, you're doing okay now. I am, I yeah, am. so mine is fairly mild, so, but you know, there are so many people who have fortunately have succumbed to the yes. disease as well. So could you also talk a little bit about how you are raising awareness? I know that you are in the pageant world, so you're yes. using your platform to help people know more about this disease and what they can do to help. I do. Um, as a representative of Florida, I use my platform constantly to bring awareness that, first off, we don't look. What do you hear all the time? Oh, you don't look sick. This is what we look like. We don't, we're not going to show our symptoms every day. And there's days where people think too that it also that diagnosis is going to limit your life. And don't get me wrong, there's a lot of changes. As you know, there's things that we do differently. But I like to stand up there and show people, like, this is still me. I'm still living my life. I was given six months to live here where we are 15 years later. I represent in the pageant world. I, you know, try to represent everybody and give them a voice and let them know that this disease is not going to win. We're going to keep fighting and we're not just going to let it win without a fight. Absolutely. And I know that you are very involved in the Lupus Foundation <laughs> yes. of America. You know, you were there at the last walk yes. at Chance's Wolf Pack, and I was the MC. And I mean, your, your team, they were deep. They were there to support you. So I know that you just have a huge support system behind you. And God is good for you to still be here and speak on this. Yes, and I'm very lucky. Um, Corner Lot Development here in Jacksonville is a big sponsor for my team. So they really showed up and you know put the money behind it and the team members. And this year, I'm hoping Chances Wolfpack is going to be even bigger. So watch out for us. We're going to come in even stronger. Um, and we loved having you there. And it m meant so much to have an MC that also understands our illness. and 
so many people don't realize and they go, oh, I didn't know, I didn't know. But you're a perfect example of what I mean every day and what I use my platform for and what the Lupus Foundation does. Bring awareness, let people know, give education out, let people know there's resources. And we do so much and we encourage everyone to constantly, you know, if you have questions or concerns, we put together a physician's list, we've put together numerous information and it's all free. Just Absolutely. reach out to us. Yeah, so it's all available on the Lupus yes. Foundation of America's yes, website. Is. And of course, if people want to support, wear purple. Yes. You can see here, this is the website. And of course, you can wear purple all month, not just today. Today is put on Purple Day, but don't just stop there. You can find out more about how to raise awareness by going again to the website. You can support Lupus Warriors like us in the mission to help find a cure. Thanks so much, Chance, Thank for you. joining us. Thank you so much. Yes.